Yak Data Smart Desktop with RStudio Desktop. It's the smart way to develop our programs, shiny web apps, and our markdown documents on your desktop. It includes R412 from the Rocker project, really nice, the RStudio IDE as a web app all wrapped neatly into Docker. Why is that important? Save hours of time to get up and running with a complete desktop IDE for R. Here you can see an example where I'm testing a shiny app developed in Yak Data Smart Desktop with RStudio Desktop. Preloaded with the Tidyverse, the Verse, and geospatial related tools from the R Rocker Org project. Text and publishing related packages from Verse. And it's designed to easily install packages from the RStudio Package Manager on a fixed date. You can easily change the default installation in the rprofile.site file. And you can easily install all the packages very quickly because it's based on Ubuntu and there are pre-built images for many of the CRAM packages in Ubuntu. For example, here I am installing from the CRAM repository on a fixed state using eCharts for R and putting it into the permanent library, Yak Data Site Library R412. So what's really nice about this is it's part of the overall Yak Data Smart Desktop, this library, so I can easily know I have everything self-contained in one subdirectory. Talk about a few more benefits. Easily access all the RStudio configuration and startup values. It's all available and easy to edit text files. End of complex uninstall upgrade paths for R and RStudio. So rather than, I've done this myself, I gotta upgrade RStudio Okay, well, I uninstall it. Oh, gee, I gotta upgrade R. I upgrade that on my Mac desktop. And pretty soon I've spent a half an hour. And then I'm like, great, now I need to go back to the old version because a particular client has an old program. Very difficult to do. Here, you won't have to do any of that mess. You could literally have 4.12. And then when I release 4.1.3, you could easily work with that. All coexisting happily on your system thanks to Docker. Easily recreate an identical environment on another system, what I was just talking about. And that will enable you to run multiple versions of R side by side. Really beautiful. And if you back up that one parent directory and all subdirectories and ship it off to someone with Dropbox or Google Drive or what have you, they'll get the exact same environment you had. I can also define various environments for a particular R version through Docker Compose, so I can get a lot of granular control, including how many resources on my system it can use, memory, CPU, etc. And I don't have to worry about system lock because an R session unexpectedly stole all of my desktop resources because again, maybe I have a four CPU machine, I only give it two CPUs and eight of my 16 gigabytes of memory, for example. Really nice, I can pause and restart a long-running R session with Docker Desktop. Well, thanks for joining me. Subscribe to this channel, like this video, add your comments, and go get your copy of Smart Desktop with RStudio Desktop at yakdata.com slash smart desktop. Thanks for watching.